What's up guys, it's Shanice, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm doing a sneaker haul, as you can see by all the shoes over here, and then I have a few over here. So I posted a picture on Snapchat asking if you guys wanted me to do a sneaker haul, and you guys said yes, so here it is. So I'm really not a sneaker head or anything like that, but I like sneakers, and if I see a sneaker or a shoe that I like, I'm gonna buy it. I'm definitely not a heel girl, like I can barely walk in heels, but I'll wear it if I have to. But yeah, so I'm going to just show you guys my new pickups as well as some of my favorites, which I've been rocking lately. And yeah, let's just hop right into the video. I'm going to try to make it as fast as possible. If you guys are interested in any of the shoes that I show you guys, the link will be in my parcel shop. So just check my parcel shop down below in the D box and everything will be there. So I guess I'll start off with my Jordans. The first shoe that I got is the Air Jordans 12, the Air Jordan 12s, and it's the retro in the color black and violet. And I got this mainly because it had purple bottoms and I'm purple is my favorite color and they just look so good together. So this is the shoe right here. These are the, the Jordan 12s and it just has the, um, the purple at the bottom. Oh, it's so beautiful. Um, and it's just so vibrant. It has the Jordan sign, gold detailing and Jordan at the back, 23 and I just love this shoe so much. I haven't even worn it yet, but I, I really do like this shoe. Haven't figured out how I'm gonna wear it. Probably with like all black or something. It's gonna just gonna pop. It's gonna pop. So I got another pair of Jordans. These are the Air Jordan ones, and these are the retro high top. Um, I got it in black and white, so it's black on white. So these just look so fresh to me, so clean. Have to put in the laces, which is annoying. But these are just so clean. I already have Air Force Ones, but I left them at Bay's house, which are pretty similar to this. But this just has the black swoosh sign or the Nike sign. And yeah, it has a little red thing right here. But I love this shoe and it's just so clean. And I got this as well is in a size 5U. Alright, so I've also been loving the Creepers, but these aren't really the real Creepers. I got this from Go Jane, but I did get a lot of questions about it when I wore it in one of my pictures. It's like this um, pinky color with... Um, what would you call it like a brown bottom which i think looks really good um the only thing about these creeper type shoes is that it makes your foot look so big and i hate looking like i have freaking clown feet so these are actually the size six but they look like they can be like a nine which is actually crazy to me so that's the only thing i don't like about creepers or these type of shoes um so yeah i also got them in black and these ones are actually from just fab and these are also in a six but they're honestly big like you can go a size down or like a half size down but yeah these look like a 10 oh my gosh but yeah I just love the black color and I like the brown so I think it goes with everything all right so in your sneaker stash you always have to have a pair of white Converse these are not necessarily the newest and like honestly once you wear these Converse like one or two times they're just gonna get dirty because they're white it's hard to keep white shoes white unless you're always cleaning it but yeah, you always have to have a pair of white Converse, so I always keep one with me because they're just, they go with everything. You can wear them with dresses and it just looks good together, so always, always gotta keep one of these. So I guess I'll show you guys all the Adidas that I got, and for me, like, I recently just got a lot of Adidas because I feel like I have, like, Adidas pants and I just don't have Adidas shoes to go with it, so I'm always, like, wearing Nike and mixing and matching. I'm like, I don't know if those two can go together. Those are, like, rivals, like, you know, Adidas, Nike, Adidas, Nike. So first up is the Adidas Superstar, and I feel like everybody just has this shoe. It's definitely a classic, um, as I would call it, uh, the shell toe, because back in the day, like, everybody had these shoes, and we would call them shell toes, so because of this part. <laughs> So yeah, I got the black stripe on white. A lot of people have this. It's definitely, it was definitely like a trendy shoe, but this definitely goes with a lot of things. You can wear this with so many things. I got these in a size four and a half. These do run very, very big. So you got a size like one, one full size down. But other than that, these are awesome shoes. So the next pair of Adidas shoes that I got are the Adidas Tubular Doom. And I got it in the colorway white and granite. So to me, I don't know why they call this granite. I guess it kind of is, but to me it's more like a gray color. So I'll say gray and white colorway. And um, I got these from Get Outside because it was honestly very hard to find these shoes, especially in my size. And honestly, everywhere they're just like sold out. So 
I had to like do some digging for this shoe. I got these in a size US 5. Um, I think that's in men's. Yeah, I think that's in men's. And yeah, so basically it has like a prime knit over here. So it's like really soft. There's a lot of room for your feet over here. It has this band across it, which I like as well. And they also have like this strap in the back and it just has the Adidas logo on it. The neat thing about this shoe is that it has a sock right here and the sock thing is like kind of in trend right now, but yeah, I just thought it was different, don't really have a shoe like it, and I thought it would look good with like sweatpants and stuff like that, and I'm always wearing sweatpants. Shoes are super, super comfortable, and yeah, I can't wait to wear these, haven't worn these yet, but I think these shoes are bomb. Alright, so the last pair of Adidas shoes that I got were the Adidas Tubular Defiant, and I got it in all black because... Literally, I've been looking for an all-black shoe for like a really long time. I thought about getting the the Hirachis, the all-black Hirachis, but I'm like, I have so many Hirachis, like I need a different type of shoe. So when I seen these, I was like, yes, I love them so much. I love the all-black look. It has like, I think this is pregnant as well. Um, and it has like a little design on it. It's like little triangles everywhere. So it's not just like all solid black. And then on the back right here is like a leather type of leather thing going on. So I like how it has the different fabrics or the materials on it or whatever. And yeah, I just really like the shoe. The tongue is kind of long in the back. And then I've heard in reviews that the this part of the back can like scrape your ankle. So you have to wear socks and stuff. But I haven't had that issue. But I just really needed an all black Adidas shoe. So I got this one. And it does have a strap in the front as well. And it keeps your foot nice and secure. And these I got in a size six and a half us oh i didn't oh yeah because it runs true to size i asked somebody if it ran true to size and they said yes so i got my actual size six and a half okay so the last pair of shoes are some nikes that i want to show you guys and uh, the first one let's see which one this is okay so these are my hirachis these are the all white hirachis and um absolutely love these shoes i have these shoes for a really hot minute now but these are shoes that i just wear when i really want like a crisp all white look for these you have to um usually size up half a size because this thing in the back right here is kind of makes your foot hard to go in and it's kind of tight on your foot so yeah usually i size i think a half size um up in these so i did get these in a seven but usually my size is six and a half but i just think that these white Hirachis are clean, they're like a must-have shoe, and yeah, I really like them a lot. Another shoe that I've been wearing so much, and like are honestly my most comfortable favorite shoes that I own right now, are these Nike Hirachis Ultras, and these are just so freaking comfortable on your feet, they're so lightweight, easy to run in, easy to walk in, and they're just so amazing, like I honestly worn these out and I didn't even have them for that long. Um, these are just in the colorway, black and white, simple stuff. Actually, I think the back is gray, unless it was white and it turned gray, but I'm pretty sure it's gray. And yeah, these are just so freaking comfortable. I want to get them in the all white as well, like the same version like this. So we'll see. I think I'm going to do it. All right, so this is the shoe that a lot of people were taking screenshots of on my Snapchat and that a lot of people are really trying to get their hands on because it's sold out in a lot of places. But... These are the, the Hirachis in the rose gold color. And yo, guys, these shoes right here are so freaking bomb. Like, do you see this? Do you see how beautiful this shoe is right here? Like, it has the rose gold. It has the gold on it. And I just feel like this is such a fall shoe. You can wear this with so much because it's like a neutral kind of color. So you can pair this with so much outfits and... The Hirachis are definitely comfortable shoes, so I had to, when I seen this on the website, I went on the Nike website, the Canadian one, when I seen this shoe, I had to put it in my cart, and I went to the checkout section right away, because I'm like, I don't want this to get sold out, and then I missed my chance on getting this shoe, because it's just that legit. These I also got in a size 7, and they're just bomb, haven't even worn them yet, I don't even want to wear them, but I got to. Alright, so these are the last shoe in my haul. These are the Nike Rochers number two. But this is the new ones, the number twos. And I got them in the colorway gray and white. Um, even the check mark is gray, so I, which I thought was pretty cool. And gray is one of my favorite colors, so I did have to pick this up as well. I just think it's like a simple shoe 
an everyday shoe that you can wear they are very comfortable they're lightweight um nothing really much to say about it to me they are similar very similar to the Rocher runs um the Rocher ones so yeah even the front right here it's very flexible so should be good for working out and all that stuff so got me this little thing so yeah guys that does wrap up my sneaker haul if you guys enjoyed this video don't forget to give me a thumbs up and again if you guys are interested in any of these shoes i will try to link all of this stuff in my parcel shop so check that out and i'll see you guys all in the next video as you can see my hair is in braids right now my friend oh my phone dropped my friend braided them for me um they're pretty nice i like them a lot and I just didn't want to have to bother with my hair while I was in Jamaica. So I'm going to wear it like this for as long as I can. If it starts getting messy or like, I don't know, I just want to take it out. 